In today's video, I'm going to be showing y'all how to fix your BMW's faulty halo bulb for 100% completely free. Now, as y'all can see, the driver's side halo of my E92 is not lighting up, even though the key is in the ignition and the little switch is on. It's just not working anymore. But if we come across to this side right here, we can actually see that my BMW halo is fully operational. And I know it looks like it's flickering. That's just because the camera can't focus on the light, but you can see that the halo itself actually works. But the other side does not. So I'm gonna be showing y'all exactly how to fix that. All right guys, so first things first, we're gonna go and unplug the battery to our BMW. We're gonna go ahead and pop the hood. Lift the hood up. So now we're gonna go ahead and do is take off the little cover that's protecting our halo bulbs. So let's go ahead and remove this with a flathead screwdriver. And now we can simply just wedge this flathead screwdriver right here. You see the little tab right there. Just go ahead and wedge it in here. Then you'll have one more on the other side right there. And you'll see that this pops up with minimal to no effort at all. So that is now removed. So now we actually have access to our halo bulb, our wiring and etc. So now I'll actually show you guys why our halo bulb isn't working. And it's something so simple. It's such an easy fix. Now our issue actually lies in here. If we actually pull out our cables, we can see we have a lot of frayed cables. We can see we have exposed wiring really all throughout. And that is a no-go. That is gonna cause this halo to short circuit and actually not work. So what we're gonna go ahead and do is tie off all this wiring with electrical tape. And now nothing fancy, you're simply gonna grab some electrical tape and go ahead, tie off all those frayed connections. Make sure here at the base as well, that this is all tied off, that way these wires don't touch. Now this is by no means perfect, but we can see that all of our frayed cables, etc., have been tied off. But for the most part, all of our frayed cables now have been protected. So now they shouldn't touch up on each other. And basically that's what's causing this to short circuit is these frayed wires are connecting and short circuiting the halo. And now let's go ahead and tuck this all back in, test that everything works before we put our little cover back on. So let's go ahead and test this halo. Let's go ahead, open up. And so now we reconnected the battery. So let's go ahead and just flip that switch on. Well, now we can go ahead and see guys that our halo bulb is 100% fully working. The issue all along was just that frayed wiring was causing the cables to touch and basically short circuit the halo bulb. So after rewrapping everything, now we can see everything's fully functional now. So I would call this job a huge success. We basically went ahead and fixed our halo bulb without needing to throw money at it and go out and buy brand new ones. And now we can go ahead and simply grab that little cover and just push it back into place. It'll be those two little push tabs. That is how you fix your BMW's faulty angel eye for 100% completely free. We did not have to go out and buy new bulbs. That is A1. That is a huge thumbs up for me. If you guys found this video helpful, go and smash that thumbs up. As always, I'll have a link down below where you can purchase all the tools that I use for this job. And make sure you leave a comment if you guys run into any issues and I'll be sure to help y'all out. But uh, yeah, we'll catch y'all in the next video. Peace out.